In this video, we're going to install an FTP sync program for Sublime Text 3. Open up Sublime Text 3, Shift Command P, Install Package it is under Package Control. Click that, wait for a second, and then type FTPS, and FTP sync is the top hit. Click it. You can see down at the bottom, it's installed. We now have a new FTP sync menu item when we right click on a folder project. So over here I have my local files. It has a CSS folder, JS folder, and index.html. Nothing's in the folders. You can see it over here. Here is my sandbox folder on my website. It's currently empty as you can see here. So let's sync this thing up. FTP sync set up sync in this folder. That adds the FTP sync settings file in which we can put in our host name, our username, and our password. My host name for this site is spartandesignweb.com with an FTP at the beginning. I'll enter my username and my password, which of course I'm not going to show, and then save it. My path is public underscore HTML and in my case I'm adding a forward slash sandbox because it's a subdomain off of my primary domain and you can see over here that it's public underscore HTML forward slash sandbox so I've prefaced it and I've matched it just like that. Let me save that. Let's now go up here FTP sync and upload this entire folder you can see down at the bottom that it's uploading stuff. If I come over here and hit refresh, I can see everything. And if I hit refresh here, there's my Hello World FTP Test 2. Now, if you remember from the beginning of this tutorial, our purpose was to FTP files automatically and not even have to have a program like CyberDuck or an FTP client at all. So we can just get rid of this thing. And now as we make changes to our site, we'll come over here and we'll add a paragraph. Save it. We can instantly refresh and there's the file. We don't have to worry about uploading or transferring or anything. It's just automatic. If you do have a brand new file that you haven't uploaded previously, you can always right click it, choose FTP sync and upload the entire thing. But that would only be when you first get started after that, every change you make would automatically be uploaded.